Good morning, parents, family members, and students culminating today. Buenos días, padres y familiares y estudiantes que están culminando hoy. Today we are honoring and recognizing our students of tomorrow. We know they, will ha they have worked hard to meet their TK and kinder goals. Congratulations, everyone, in Mr. Munoz's class. This year we have seen them grow, develop, and learn so much. My thanks and appreciation to Mr. Munoz, as well as Ms. Mesa, and as well as you two parents for the role that you all have played in supporting your children at home this school year. Hoy estamos honrando y reconociendo nuestros estudiantes del futuro. Sabemos que han trabajado mucho para lograr las metas de kinder. Este año hemos mirado a los estudiantes crecer, desarrollar y aprender mucho. Les quiero dar las gracias y agradecimiento a, al señor Tey, Mr. Muñoz, Tellez, Mr. Muñoz y la señora Mesa, padres y padres por el trabajo que han tomado en enseñar a sus hijos en casa. Now students, I need to tell you how very, very proud I am of you today. You are incredible, special, incredibly special people. You have worked very hard to learn so much this year. You have made new friends and have been a good friend too. Well done and congratulations to each and every one of you. You can feel very proud of everything you have accomplished this year. Ahora estudiantes, yo quiero decirles que estoy muy orgullosa de ustedes hoy. Son personas muy especiales y increíbles. Han trabajado muy arduamente a aprender mucho cada día. Han hecho nuevas amistades y han sido un buen amigo también. Bien hecho y felicidades a cada uno de ustedes. Deben de sentirse muy orgulloso por todo lo que han hecho. I would like to tell you, my Sierra Vista Eagles, to enjoy being five as long as you can. Yo quiero decirles a mis estudiantes que disfruten siendo cinco y seis con toda su alma y corazón. To my parents out there, today is a very special day. Today is the beginning of their education. As parents and teachers, we put a lot of time and energy into preparing our children for their future. It is our responsibility to prepare our children with lifelong skills, which will get them ready for middle school, high school, and college. It is our responsibility to teach them and support them for the next 12 years to prepare them to graduate high school. We need to instill in them how important education is and encourage them to go to college we want to see all of our Sierra Vista students graduate from high school and definitely go to college one day. They are the future generation. Hoy es un día muy especial para los niños. Hoy es el comienzo de su educación. Como padres y maestros han puesto mucho tiempo y energía para prepararlos para el futuro. Es nuestra responsabilidad de preparar a nuestros niños para la escuela intermedia, secundaria y el colegio. Es nuestra responsabilidad de apoyarlos para los siguientes 12 años hasta que, sean graduan, hasta que se gradúen de la secundaria. Les tenemos que inculcar que la educación es muy importante y apoyarlos para que vayan al colegio. Ellos son el futuro. Congratulations, my Sierra Vista Eagles. I wish you a life full of learning, education, and success. I hope you have an incredible journey in the next 12 years of learning. And as Dr. Seuss always says, you're off to great places. Today is your day. Your mountain is waiting, so get on your way. Parents, thank you for joining us today. Students, let's get on with the celebration, okay? Felicidades, niños y niñas. Les deseo una vida de aprendizaje, educación y éxito. Muchas gracias por acompañarnos hoy. And with that, I'm gonna go ahead and pass it over to Mr. Munoz. Thank you. Thank you, Ms. Arias. Uh, parents, thank you so much for being here today. We're very excited to be able to present. Right, boys and girls? Yeah! So, but before I start, I wanna go ahead and give some thanks to some people that have helped us uh, make this year a very successful year. I first wanna start off with my TA, Ms. Mesa. Thank you, Ms. Mesa, for uh, doing such a great job this year of helping us with our students. So we're very lucky to have you. Ms. Rodriguez, as well, is one of our TAs that comes, and she does a really great job with my boys and girls. So Ms. Rodriguez, thank you so much. Uh, I also want to thank Mr. Lazo for coming out here every day in the mornings and helping us. 
So Mr. Lazo, thank you so much for uh, assisting us in anything that you may need. I also want to thank Ms. Theus. Ms. Theus uh, and I worked together in kindergarten this year and it's been an amazing year. Ms. Theus, uh, we definitely have been a great team this year and uh, I'm very, very uh, thankful and happy to have you with me uh, throughout the school year, so thank you. Uh, I also want to thank Ms. Palicio for assisting us with everything that she needed this year. Ms. Palicio, you're awesome. Thank you so much for everything that you've done for our class as well. I also want to thank the people that created this today, uh, Christine, Ms. Mosqueda, and the Parent Center. Thank you so much. It looks amazing. And last but not least, I want to thank my principal, Ms. Arias. Thank you for your support this year. I really appreciate it. Uh, it's, been a great, it's been a great school year. Uh, parents, this is for you. Uh, it's, been an it's been an amazing school year with your little ones. Uh, the amount of growth that we, that we as a team have seen is remarkable, but this growth in their education takes a team effort and we have done a great job of it, parents. I'm truly blessed to have such a great group of parents. Continue to support them through their years in education. Regardless of how much more older and taller they get, they're gonna need your support throughout the years of their education. And this one's for my students. Are we, are we ready, boys and girls? Yeah. This is for you. These are my special words to you guys. To my students, Mr. Munoz is extremely proud of every single one of you. All of you have learned so much this year. We know our letters and our sounds. We know how to write our first name and our last name. We now know how to say and write our numbers to 100 or even more than that, huh? We also know many sight words and well, we can't forget that we know how to put them in sentences now, don't we? We learned about how flowers grow, how farmers take care of their farms. We learned about different types of animals and their habitat. And we also learned how to make a pinball machine through the, through the, through the use of force and push. You boys and girls are so, so smart. However, my biggest satisfaction as your teacher is watching every single one of you care so much about each other. We are a great family. From the days of, I want to go home, crying and some of you trying to run out of my class and hope that you see your parents outside of the fence, to now seeing your enjoyment, boys and girls, and loving school so much, those are the memories that I will remember the most. People often tell me that teaching little minds requires so much patience and understanding, and that's true. But this group of students, I would do it 100 more times with you guys. Room two, you are very special and all have little great minds that will lead you far in life. Mr. Munoz will miss every single one of you in different ways, but I know that I have prepared you to be a big boy. Your, your next school teacher will be lucky to have every single one of you. Always try your best, boys and girls. Thank you. Now, parents, we're gonna go ahead and, put, and do a song that we've done all year long from the very first day. Are you guys ready to perform? Good morning. Yeah. Oh.
one too. All right, so now boys, uh, boys and girls are gonna get an opportunity to tell what they wanna be when they grow up. So, room two, are you ready? Yeah! Let's go.
parents, this is a time where boys and girls will be receiving their certificates for completing kindergarten or completing TK. The first person, Aaron Flores. Natalia Robles. Got it better than us. Yeah. 